If you've ever wondered about multiple income streams and how you can diversify your income, earn more money and become financially independent, this video is for you and this channel is also for you. Today we're diving into the world of financial freedom, specifically how to secure that bag with some passive income stream. You know, money that keeps flowing even when you're chilling at the beach, when you're with your family, when you're busy at work, that good stuff. For each stream of income I'm going to mention, I'll talk about the pros, the cons, how to start and some success tips. So grab your notepads because this is about to get really good. There's something for everyone in this video. If you're a creative, a 9 to 5 career person, an entrepreneur, even someone that is scared of losing money I got you so just watch to the very end and make sure you don't skip anything number one become an online course creator there is something that you know how to do in today's digital age the demand for online learning is soaring which allows for a tremendous opportunity for individuals to become successful course creators the ability for you to share your knowledge your expertise your passions your experience with a global audience will change the game for you this year so you can monetize those skills that you have by creating courses that you can offer for both personal fulfillment in the sense that you're helping people and financial rewards because they are paying you for the value that you're offering. What are the pros? You get to share your knowledge, you build an audience, and it's a scalable income because you can have more than one course. And the best part is that you just need to create the course once and it can sell even while you sleep. What are the cons? It requires upfront work to create a course, research, filming, editing, which can be outsourced and also marketing is needed. How do you start? Identify your expertise. Is it cooking? Is it makeup? Is it coding? Next, you want to choose a platform. Film that course, edit it, and then promote it. For your success tip, Focus on a specific niche, build an audience, and provide high quality content. Number two, ebooks. An ebook is a short form for electronic book. It's a digital form of a printed book designed to be read on devices like computers, tablets, or smartphones. Because when you think about it, how many times do people have time to read hard copy books these days? So if you're able to create valuable content and put in an ebook, you're on your way to making good money. For the pros, one-time creation and you can create it from everywhere and also reach a global audience for the cons it's quite a competitive market to break into but it's doable if you do the right marketing required to drive sales how do you start number one choose a topic that you're passionate about number two write your book you can self-publish it or find a publisher and number three promote it online for your success tip market your book on platforms like Amazon KDP and leverage social media for promotion if you have writing skills use them to create social media content that engages your target audience and then introduce them to your ebook number three I love this one become a content creator a decade ago who would have known that anyone could earn six figures from talking to the camera like I am right now in the conference of your own home fast forward to today over 50 million people worldwide are creating content and earning money just by sharing unique content that educates or entertains their audience and this my dear can be you you don't necessarily need some special skills or training to become a successful content creator if you can consistently produce content and share your ideas in a fun and educational and engaging way you will succeed and maybe you can become other people's favorite content creator but the pro you have creative freedom you get to build a community and there's so many streams of income from this particular idea for the cons it takes time to build an audience and you need to be consistent in your content creation how do you start choose a niche you love create high quality content and also promote your channel or your page across platforms success tip learn to engage with your audience and listen to what they want Optimize your content for search engines and collaborate with other creators. Number four, digital products. Digital products are intangible goods that exist in a digital format. You know, it could be packaged content, music, digital arts, software, online courses, eBooks, virtual goods, and all of that. They're typically delivered to your customers via download or email and offer businesses a way to provide value without having physical inventory. What are the pros? Low overhead costs. You don't have to hold in 
inventory or incur any shipping charges. So there's high profit margins because there are no recurring cost of goods. So you get to maintain majority of your sales and profits. There's also potential to automate because orders can be delivered instantly with no oversight. For the cons, it requires initial time and effort to create. There's also market saturation because you're competing with free content. You want to be careful about picking your niche, the type of products you sell and how you write your product descriptions. How do you start? Identify your passion, your expertise, create ebooks, courses or printables on them and sell them by building your own online store on e-com platforms, maybe like Shopify or you can sell your digital products to your audience via social media. Success tip offer valuable content and provide excellent customer service so that your clients can leave great reviews. All right, guys, hit the like button and let me know in the comments what has been your favorite passive income idea so far. And as you watch, I want you to drop your comments below. Don't forget to subscribe while you are at it. Number five, promote other people's products if you've ever bought something because an influencer or a celebrity recommended it online you've likely come across an affiliate marketing business online creators often build partnership with brands to promote their products and services in return they earn a commission for each sale affiliate marketing is the process of earning commission by recommending a product or service offered by another business as a business model, it can be highly profitable because the business pays you for every referred sale. For the pros, low investment, multiple income streams, and you can work from anywhere. For the cons, it's reliant on commissions, requires promoting the products that you may not believe in. How do you start? Join affiliate programs or brands that you love, promote their products on your website, your social media, your blog, or whatever platform you have, earn commissions of any sale that you make. For your success tip, Leverage your social media marketing skills to build a strong online presence. Choose high quality products for your audience so that when they use it, they can come back for more. Number six, outsourcing freelance gigs. Many people often ask if they can offer freelance services without having skills and the answer is yes. It's basically like offering dropshipping for services. You link clients to freelancers and take a percentage cut. For the pros, there are no upfront skills needed, no major work in delivering and it's location independent. For the cons, it requires sourcing freelancers all the time and marketing is needed for sales. How do you start? Choose a skill, create an offer, get clients, hire contracts, freelancers and deliver your project. For your success tip, source for excellent freelancers so that you can have recurring clients, provide excellent customer service, and encourage reviews to build trust. Number seven, buy an existing business. Look guys, when I understood this part, it blew my mind. It's simply buying an already existing business. When you think about it, there are a lot of businesses that are thriving, but they have retiring owners that don't have any plan for succession for their business. So if you discover such business or businesses, you can buy it off legally and skip to making profit immediately. For the pros, high income potential, passive income if your management is outsourced. For your cons, it requires an understanding of the business model or you need to hire an efficient manager. How do you start? Identify a business that is profitable, speak to the owner or hire a negotiator, sign legal documents and start your business. For the success tip, focus on a profitable market prioritize efficient management and market the business well. Number eight, rent out unused items. Last year, I did a complete overhaul of my home and I found a lot of unused items. If that's the case for you, you can rent out or even sell out some of those items. For the pros, you can turn unused items into income, low maintenance, and it's also environmental friendly. For the cons, you have limited income potential and managing returns and rentals can be a hassle. How to start, list your items on e-com platform or your social media, set rental prices and communicate effectively with your renters. For your success tips, offer a variety of high quality items, provide clear descriptions and photos and ensure a smooth rental experience. For the music maven, sell your music online. My dear vocal legends, choir members, song stars, your gifts can make room for you. So you can record songs, singles, covers, and upload them on YouTube and other platforms that pay. For the pros, share your musical talent, reach a global audience, and you can create passive income if your music goes viral. For the cons, it's a competitive market, so you need to build your following all the time. How do you start? Produce high quality content, upload your music to music platforms or YouTube, and promote your music online. For success tips, 
find your niche network with other musicians and consistently release new music to stay relevant and you never know which one will go viral so my next tip is for the investment gurus and it's peer-to-peer -peer lending you don't want to start a business maybe because you barely have time for it or you have other businesses or you work nine to five but you have a ton of friends who are business oriented why not become an investor in their business? Many small to medium businesses constantly need funds so you can lend to them at a profit. For the pros, there are potentially higher returns than traditional investments based on your agreement. You can also diversify your business portfolio. For the cons, there are higher rates of borrower default and you have to do your research. I love this. High yield savings account. So you're a low risk person and you're scared of everything. <laughs> I have something for you. Start a high yield savings account. High yield savings accounts reward you with a higher interest rate than traditional savings accounts, making your money grow faster as it sits in your account. The interest rate that this account offer is noted as APY or annual percentage yield. The higher your APY, the faster your money grows. For the pros, low risks and it's easy to start. For the cons, it's lower than other investments. How do you start? Research banks that offer high interest rates open an account. For the success keys, regular deposits, monitoring interest rates for account optimization. Even as you implement this passive income skills, as we mentioned in the last video, skill stacking will maximize your earning potential. Think about the skills you already have and how you can combine them with these passive income ideas. For example, if you're great at writing, you can create an ebook and leverage your social media skills to promote it. The possibilities, my dear, are endless. Before you go, don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more financial tips. It only takes a second. Leave a comment below letting me know which passive income idea you're excited about. What will you be starting this year? Because I want to know. Share this video with all your loved ones and help grow this community and this channel. Remember that you're capable of achieving anything you set your mind to do. Take action, be persistent, and watch your wealth grow. Until next time, I am rooting for you. Bye.